Our relationship is now to a step that you may need to know that I exist. Don't you think, Dougie? Hi, messy ponytails, Red Bull, I guess you have an impression of déjà vu? It may be normal, I'm like, my hair are the same as the last week's vlog, I'm sorry. I mean, today has been a rough day for me. Uh, actually, we are Tuesday, I wasn't supposed to tell it, but yep, and yep, today has been really hard because I fell asleep late last night, so I'm really tired, I'm like, blah, but I'm going to be happy for you for the vlog. Yeah. I was rushing today because I couldn't get home this afternoon so I went to my friend's house and after my mom went to pick me up and we went to shopping and I bought this beautiful owl with purple ribbon see what I did there I bought it just for the vlog I mean I was searching in Walmart and all the clothes and it's the only shirt I loved with purple on it so yeah and so yeah because tomorrow like today when you're probably watching this, I'll be probably in the bus in direction to Boston! Happiness. Yeah. Um, so, yep, yeah, I'm going with the school on a trip to Boston. So, this week vlogs are favorite member of McFly. of a super duper British accent. Maybe as you've seen in my little intro, I have a poster of Dougie. But I'm not in my room, oh my god, what's happening? Well, I'm in my sister's room because it's brighter because of the walls. But the room is purple. Yes, we can see, but it's kind of purple, like the drapes, the curtain, sorry, are purple and everything. So it's good, I'm still in the team. Yeah, so for this week's vlog, I'm going to be in her room. But next week, I'll be in my room. So sorry for my ugly hair and my ugly face and everything. And let's start now. Favorite member? Well, since the beginning of McFly, so... No, no, favorite member? Well, since the first time I saw a picture of McFly, my favorite member has always been Dougie. Um, and after it was Ari, Danny, and after Tom. Because when I first discovered McFly, well, I didn't really like Tom. Yep, to be honest. I mean... I don't know, I just didn't really like him. I will... No, I just didn't. I don't know what. So, well, how can I explain that? It's not hard, really, but I mean, I will surely sound like a fangirl. So, sorry for in advance for this. I hope I didn't, uh, but I will surely. But, anyway. My first number of McFly that I really, 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 really love, it's Dougie. I mean, I don't know if you can see it well. Maybe I should put it more here. Yeah, I'll put it there. It's okay. Yeah, okay. Then you had the sexy Harry Chot. Here. Oh, there. Then you had the sexy Danny. Here. And then you had them that I didn't really like, so I'm just going to put there. Okay. First, in 2008, this was like my top four. I mean, when I was in 2008, I mean, I could have literally just didn't put them. I mean, I was going to put stick there in my, on the wall, and I think everything. So, first you had Dougie, that was really cute in 2008. It was really, like, it was the youngest, it was weird, funny, and everything, and it still is today. And after you had Harry, that had an amazing body, that was really sexy, was a drummer, it was total, okay, it was... Oh. Then you had Danny with his beautiful body, his V-line. Oh my god, and I'm still fantasizing on this. Um, yeah, and he was kind of cute. And then you had Tom. But yeah, Tom. I, mean, oop, I don't mind. You're, you was, he wasn't looking that good. I mean, before 2008, I mean, in my opinion, in my friend's opinion. I know I may have some haters because of that, but I don't care, it's my opinion before. Don't click on the red X, just stay on my vlog, okay? Thank you. Then, with that sign, things 
start to change. I slowly start to like him Tom as much as I love Danny. Um, I mean, I don't know, with the time, I mean, when I became, I, like, I sing up on Twitter, um, for the first time because of Tom, um, I don't know, I start liking him more, and reading was fun, but more times come, I don't know, but I kind of took a walk down Danny, and Danny and Tom, because they are flowns and they are always together, they went on the top. So it was Doki, Danny, Tom less than Danny, and then you had Harry Chad. But then 2010 and 2011 began everything changed. In 2000, end of 2010 and um, 11, sorry, they began. Things changed, like I said, and I will still stay on the bottom because I didn't trust him yet. And I don't know. Danny kind of was tired to being like between Pud and Tom decide to get between and make wars. Yeah. And Danny start decide to stay out of it. So this became my top favorite member. Um uh, yeah. But with the time again, 2011 passed, a few months, till here, well, maybe more by the, by the end of 2010. Um, time for really no reason. Maybe because I was really with my Miss Fletcher often. I don't know, I, I passed a lot of time with her, and she was a Tom lover, so... What? What happened? Oh my god, Tom, what are you doing? Oh gosh. He came here. I mean, he's not as much as Dougie, but really, Tom is like one of the cutest, the more Greek, the more, the more, the more talented guy ever, the most romantic and anything. And then Danny, well, he kind of came back between Pod because he felt like coming back home. Well, for Ari, he kind of. Mm, how can I say? Come here. He's not as much as Danny, but I kind of really love him now. Not that he's more on Twitter or anything, but like with Super City and Tumblr, everything like we know everything about him, kind of. And yep, I mean, I start liking back Harry. Yeah. So, Doogie, I've always been in the top. I mean, is it because, I don't know if it's because it's like the baby of the band, but it's like, it's really cute and it's weird and weird people, I love them, okay? He play bass like a god. Um, it just, it's so cute, I mean, his eyes are perfect, I mean, blonde guy with blue eyes, please, just give them all to me now, okay? Then you have the amazing Tom Fletcher. Um, Tom, 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 Tom. What can I say about you, amazing human being? He's talented. He is like a Disney lover. He's like so childish when he wants. Uh, he's a Greek, I guess what like, like, we call that. Yes, like Star Wars and all this stuff. It's really cute. It's really romantic, as I heard, read, and saw. Um, yeah, he's talented, he's funny, and he's really, he seems really nice. I didn't meet him, but the f some of my friends and fans on Tumblr met him, and apparently he's like really sweet and nice, and he's like so cute, so isn't the second in my heart. Then you have uh, Danny, yes, with like a story that everybody knows, uh, with the song Not Alone and everything. Um, like he's one of the strongest one of the strongest guys, that guys, person, whatever you want, that I ever met in my life, and so, and he's really, really, really talented, I mean, he plays guitar like a god, and I'm just, why don't you just give me your talent already, oh, so, yep, uh, with Danny, um, I mean, he's really, really, really sexy with his amazing of the lines and everything, um, and I mean he's just gorgeous and sexy, talented and really sweet, nice, funny, really funny and the stupidity is really cute 
and uh, yeah, that's why it's third in my top that you see in the other minutes earlier. And then you have Harry Chad. Well, um, is sexy. We can't deny it with the muscle and everything. I mean, blah, 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 just give me him already. Um, <laughs> and also, <clears throat> sorry. Um, I love his little bromance with Doggy. They are really cute together. That's why I'm a pod supporter. And um, he's an amazing drummer. He's really sweet, as I heard of him. And yep. That's why he's uh, the fourth in my heart. Well, <laughs> that's all. So, goodbye guys, see you next week. And if you have comments, uh, requests, challenge or anything, just t write them in the comment section box, whatever below. Or just email the Five Colors Girls blog. Or you can also go in my on my Tumblr, the link is also in the great thingy bar down anyway so yeah bye bye